Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. My name's Mel. Thank you so much for joining me today for a booktuber shoutouts video. So today I'm going to talk to you about four booktubers that I absolutely love and let you know why I think you should subscribe to them. All of their details are listed in the description below so you can go and check out their channels and subscribe and yeah that's what we're going to do today. The way that I have been doing this is I have a list of booktubers on my phone and then I'm using a number generator to randomly generate the numbers, go to find who is in that number spot and that is who I will talk to you about today. So let's dive straight in shall we? Okay so I have 68 people listed here and the first number I have is 64 which is for Novel T Corner. So this is Steph and Steph is a fellow Australian. I really really enjoy Steph's channel. I am constantly amazed at how much she can read. I think she's up to like 300 and something books this year which to me is just amazing. She does regular weekly wrap-ups where she talks about all the books she's read in that week and honestly sometimes she's read more books than I in that week than I have read in a month. I really think that she's very articulate with what she talks about and the way that she expresses how she feels about the books which I really really enjoy and yeah she just is very relaxed it's very easy to listen to and watch just all around a really lovely time. Steph is also a teacher and she does sometimes review children's books which I really appreciate as well. It's something that I do on my channel as you guys probably know and I always love to find new children's books that I can take to school so yeah that's something I really appreciate about Steph as well. So that was Steph from the Novelty Corner. Next person 41 which is the awkward book nerd. So this is Alana. I haven't actually seen anything from her for a little while so I'm really hoping that she'll be back and making content again soon. Um, but yeah, Alana is an American booktuber. She is super enthusiastic about anything that she's been enjoying reading. Gets involved in lots of different readathons and she's just a really, I don't know, I feel like she's just a ray of sunshine. Um, she's always very enthusiastic and happy and smiling which is always so nice to see. So yeah I just really appreciate Alana's content. Um, like I said I love to have her enthusiasm and her just her joy at what she's reading and what she's talking about on my feed. It's always really lovely and again I feel like I am sitting down with someone having a chat and chatting about books which is always really nice. So yeah I highly recommend that you go and check out The Awkward Book Nerd third person number 19 which is Becca and the books. Do I really even need to tell you about Becca? She is a really quite big booktuber and she is very well known because she does Bookopolathon which is a really really fun readathon that runs every single September. I've taken part in both the month-long versions of this and really enjoyed them and also the live version that she did earlier this year which I think was a weekend and really enjoyed that as well. Becca reads a lot of fantasy um, so I feel like we have that in common. Probably my favourite thing on her channel is Bookopoly so every single month she plays Bookopoly and that decides her TBR but in general I enjoy her content. Again it feels very much like you are sitting having a chat with someone who's just super enthusiastic and excited about books and really really enjoys books. Becca also is the owner and creator of I think the company is called Grace and Honey so she does book inspired candles. I haven't bought any of her stuff mostly because we have three cats one of whom very interested in candles in the put her thing her hand in and check out the burning tip of the candle so yeah <laughs> but if you like candles and you like books go check out as well okay and the final booktuber for today is number one let's see who that is Victoria from what Victoria read again someone who I think is really well known certainly in the booktube world that I live in. I know that it's actually quite vast but the part of the little part of the community that I live in, Victoria is very well known. She is probably one of the nicest people 
on booktube i absolutely love her channel i just feel like i am having a really lovely chat with a really good friend whenever i watch all of her videos i feel safe i feel warm and I feel, yeah, like I'm just having a chat with a good friend. I really, really recommend that you go and subscribe to Victoria's channel. And yeah, I just, she's very welcoming and totally love Victoria. So definitely go and check her out, her channel out. <laughs> All right, so those are the four people that I highly recommend that you go and subscribe to their channel. Watch some of their videos. Have a great old time. Please comment below if you have any suggestions of people you think I should check out that I would really like or if you have any thoughts about this whole thing as a concept or just thoughts in general. I would love to have a chat with you in the comments below. If you would like to leave me a comment but you don't know what then leave me some kind of like camera emoji because we're talking about booktubers. So filming. All of my social media details are listed in the description below so if you'd like to go and follow me on any of those other platforms please feel free to do so. And yeah, Thank you so much for watching. I really do hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, I would absolutely love it if you would subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up. Like I said, thank you so much for watching. I really do hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you next time.